the filings we'll go ahead and put this grease around here and chances are if you know what you're doing the drill bit will follow the hole don't go hog wild yeah take it out we cut we got to catch all those filings we did have to tape off the whole area around it we saved this thing from having any more engine trouble go ahead and leave this up with some cutting oil to do this it's easy to go ahead and get it cocked and most most time it's going to want to follow the hole look at the other bolt holes and see if they're facing kind of straight up and down or at an angle all right and what i did was i went ahead and put one of the other bolts in to see what angle it was at to make sure that i'm doing the same appropriate angle just line them up with each other and don't want to jam this in the hole most of the time when you got it lined up right it'll want to start biting pretty pretty quickly and it'll tell you got it you can tell you got it correct you shouldn't have to fight it too much once you get started all right and so i've got this here at the same angle as this one here that's how i know it's correct you don't want to get some big long one and get way too much leverage on it and make you know, make it work. It should it should want to work itself. I right. want to look at it just from the front and make sure that it's, it's correct. That it's not cocked one way or cocked the other way. You got that stuff. You got it you know, tapped before you put your helicoil and you get all this crap out of the way. All right. There's a little bit of shavings left all the way at the bottom of this. You don't need to worry about this little bit down here. That, that'll be okay. All right, guys, check this out. We're gonna put this this helic oil in. If you have a time cert, that's the way to. That's the way you should do it. Unfortunately, we can't do it that way because the customer said he needs this car back now. I said, you want to fix right? Or you want to fix right now? He said, oh no. Yeah. Okay. Get your Loctite on there. Yeah, you can put a pretty big glob on there. It's all right. You can't hurt anything. Jam, do not jam this in the hole, guys. All right? Just turn this right in here. Let's turn this in. You want to keep pressure on it? Go ahead and continue to just turn it in. We want it to go a little bit below. We don't want it level with the top of the surface. Just like the threads start below the surface for the ones that are already there. All right, here's what we just did. We're just below the surface where the good threads start. That's where we want it. This one here has is, is original. You can see that it's just down a little bit. And we'll take a little punch and knock that tab off on the edge. Take your punch, pop it in there, give a little smack, pop, and you insert or heel coil in. Go ahead and go through. Do not, do not zap them. Don't do the dacted axe with this one. All right. We want to make sure that we got a solid heel coil in, so that it will, that we can get a torque spec out of it. So I'm just gonna give it a couple clicks just to get it started. And then this one and this one are the ones that we put a uh, the helicoil in. So, all right. So the torque spec for this is uh, it's 86 inch pounds. So let's go and see if we got it. If we get a torque spec out of it, we knew we did a good job with this helicoil. And there it is. Let's see if we got this one. I mean, we want to get a torque spec out of all of them. Nice. And I gotta take my kids, I gotta take my son Denver to his piano lesson, because that's what good dads do. Okay! They take care of their kids. They don't go ahead and just have their fun and be done. Good dads go ahead and take care of their kids. Click, talked, 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 
and torques. Check one more time. We've got the torque. We're torquing, not twerking. We don't do any twerking here. Uh uh, son. All right, guys, that's it. Um, you're ready to go ahead and put the valve cover back on. Make sure you torque it down, get a torque spec out of it so you know it's good to go. Uh, don't cruise by the high school with this. Not that cool. Uh uh, son. Uh, go pack up, get your family some groceries. You know, that's what men do to take care of their family. Awesome. Hey, if this helped, uh, please like and subscribe and send me some money if you want to. I'll see you guys next time. Thanks a lot for your viewership.